Okay, to continue with what I'm showing you. Yeah. After that, we we'll have these connectors that you are seeing. This one is RF mail plug. RF mail plug. And also we have RF female plug. RF female plug. The reason why they are called male and female plug is that this one has a pin inside. Why this one? This one that is a female has a hole inside. So this one can actually go inside this, just like this. So I've clipped two of them together. So this is a male and a female plug, RF. So I'm telling you the names so that you know them. If you want to go to where they are selling anything satellite dish around you, just tell them that you need RF male plug and RF female plug. That will show them that you are an installer. You know something concerning installation. Then this you are seeing here is F to F connector. F to F connector. The reason why they call it F to F connector is that this one they call F connector can go inside here. So this is F connector. F connector. F as in father. F as in father. F connector. Another type of F connector is this. This is also F connector. The same function with this type. The only thing is that this one is more superior than this. Uh, but two of them do the same work. So this is F connector. So when you carry when you carry this F connector, you can connect it here. You can just go inside. This is F to F connector because of you can attach F connector here and also attach another F connector this side. Do you see? So you can clip this one, you can clip this one. So this F to F, this one they call F to F, you use it to join two wires. You know that RG6 coaxial cable will enter here, another RG6 coaxial cable will enter here. So from there you can join two wires together which will allow the wire to continue with the passage of the current in a straight line. So this is F to F and F connector. So that is how we join them. So in satellite dish installation, you will keep on using these materials as I'm showing you now. F to F connector, F connector, F connector as well. Why these ones are RF male and female plug. So when it comes to installation as well, we use this nail you are seeing, concrete nail two inches. Concrete nail two inches. I use these two inches a lot because based on experience, I've discovered that these two inches last in any installation that we are using it for. If you use it to nail dish against the wall, it stays longer and durable because if you there are some installers that are using one inch one inch one inch is not all that good if you use one inch when heavy breeze blows it will just blow off the dish and the the, the client will start calling you back again and saying that you don't know the, the work you are doing you're not a professional so like myself if I go any installation for any client of mine, I'll make sure that I give my work durability of one year plus. So the person will enjoy his satellite dish installation that I've done for him or her for one year and above before talking about maintenance. That makes you a good satellite dish installer. So having shown you all this, I was to show you the bags, the kind of bags I use for my own tools. This is the kind of bag I use for my tools. I use, have you seen how the hand is very strong? The hand is very strong, so I use this type of bag for my satellite dish tools. 
So when, once I carry all of them and put it inside here, it will be very okay for me to carry to any location where I want to go and do my satellite dish installation work. Another bag I use also is this type. I use this type as well. If I want to hang it on my back, I will just hang it on my back. So you can get any of these, either this one or this type I'm showing you. So when you have all these that I'm showing you now, they are the basic satellite dish installation tools that you need. Once you get them, you are on your way becoming a professional satellite dish installer and you make a good amount of money from it. Any installation I go and cover, I'm receiving 6,000 6, Naira. I'm receiving 10,000 Naira for just 30 minutes. 30 minutes work, you will have this kind of amount. So depending on your country, depending on your location, you can charge depending on the currency that we are using there. So all these are the satellite dish installation tools I want to show you for this class. So if you like it, try to remember. Remember to subscribe to this channel. Remember to subscribe to this channel so that as I'm dropping these, the videos, you will be getting every information that you need right on top of your gadget. If you are using phone, if you are using desktop, subscribe to this channel. Turn on the notification icon so that anytime I drop awesome videos, you keep on getting the notification and you follow me step by step. Before you know it, you become a professional satellite dish installer. Thank you and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.